glad to be alive and proud to be an American. And uh, I'm stuttering a bit. I have a beautiful girl here in the studio. <laughs> Hi, this is Tia Jackson. Is that right? Yes. Yeah, you you are representing Hooters because we have the grand opening. Uh, I'm not sure if it's tonight or tomorrow. Um, tomorrow grand it's, opening. Is is to, tomorrow? Okay, yeah. but isn't there something going on tonight with uh, with you know winning uh, wings for a year or something? <laughs> there is. Yes, tonight's our VIP party, and in addition to that, at 9 p.m. we have a huge tent set up outside, and we're giving the first 200 people that show up uh, free wings for a year. So it's 10 free wings a week for a year. Really? Yeah. Have they done this before? Uh, no, this is the first time, so it'll be interesting. Yeah, have you driven by? Is there like a long line of people there? Are they going to camp out? With, I mean, have people been sleeping there overnight or yeah, what? Yeah, there's been people there like setting up tents and stuff. And, uh, yeah. <laughs> I was there a couple hours ago and it's already starting to get crazy. Right on. Uh, so, Tia Jackson, uh, you're, you got like a long, you're like a calendar girl for Hooters, and what else? I do a lot of fun Hooters stuff. I got in the top 10 for the Hooters International swimsuit pageant last year. I'd like to lot, do a lot of fun Hooters stuff. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, I can't resist. All right. Like, um, yeah, we do a lot of fun stuff with Hooters, like Hooters Dream Girls and Hooters Snow Angels. Oh, all right, what's a Hooters Dream Girl? Hooters Dream Girl. They took us to Cancun, Mexico, and we did a bunch of competitions. They filmed us for a nine days straight, and we did all these like little crazy things and did photo shoots and all that fun stuff. And uh, they aired it live, and then everyone got to vote for their favorite Hooters girl. And the winner got ten grand. Oh, how'd you do? Did you get ten grand? I did not. <sighs> But it's okay. It's okay? Yeah, we're looking forward to the pageant this year. Do they have, like, Hooters DVDs and stuff, or what? They do. They do. They film the pageant each year, and you can buy a DVD from that. Right. Is there, like, a, I mean, I know there's a Hooters.com website, right? Yep. And uh, is there, like, an insider's club where you get to see, like, a little more or something like that? If you... <laughs> <laughs> If you mean underneath, no. No, but, <laughs> no you can inside information about Hooters or whatever. Uh, well, yeah, you can sign up for our email club, and, you know, we... Um, do specials each month and stuff, so you can sign up for the club on, uh, it's on the Hooters Facebook, and there's a HootersCalendar.com. You can go to either one of those and sign up. All right, so uh, it's Tia Jackson. She's a spectacular Hooters girl. She's in town representing the uh, new one on Wolf Road in Colony with a grand opening tomorrow, which, what time is it actually open in the morning? It's 11 a.m. till 1 a.m. Okay. Uh, and you, uh, where are you a Hooters girl? You're not a Hooters girl around here in the Capital Region. No, I'm a trainer, so I came from Saugus, Massachusetts. That's my home store. Ah, okay. And so there's a, is there a Hooters right there on Route 1 or something? There is, yes. Because, right. uh, you know, I'm a New England guy. Yeah. And uh, <laughs> they still got, uh, what else goes on there around Route 1? Is there uh, What is it? Kowloon's. What's that? It's uh, the ch the Asian restaurant. Oh, okay. Restaurant. Oh, okay. Yeah. It's not We're like right the... across the street from it. Okay, it's not like the golden banana or anything like that? No. Okay. no. <laughs> you are from New England, and uh, I know you're, 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 uh, see, you're, you're seeing you guys going, come on, stop with that, would you? So you're from New England, so you're a Red Sox fan, I know that, right? I am. And are you a Bruins fan, too? I am. Did you watch the game oh last night? Oh my gosh, night? so excited. Yes, I did. Did you watch all the games in the series? I tried to. Unfortunately, I was working some of the time, and when you're working, you don't really get to pay attention to the game because you got too much going on, but... Yeah. I did the best I could, and it what, was awesome. You know what was really cool? I watched uh, the last few games. I've started. I've watched the pregame and everything. And during the national anthem uh, in Canada last night, it was so cool because uh, the, during the middle part of Canada's national anthem, Oh Canada, the, the singer stopped, and he let the entire crowd sing the whole middle part, which was something that I've never really heard. Because I think most of us here in the U.S., we don't even know all the words to it, do we? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I think some of us just melted. it. Yeah, I thought that was really cool to watch. So, And then uh, did you watch any of the crazy stuff going on in uh, Vancouver afterwards with the fires and those people just going crazy? I was unable to know. I, I wish I would have seen it. I now. can't understand. There's only six arrests in Boston, but in Vancouver they're just going absolutely crazy, lighting stuff on fire. And, yeah, you got to be upset, you know? Uh, it's a bummer. All right, so there's a broadcast <laughs> tomorrow, and uh, that starts, I believe, at 10 o'clock. Uh, my man Rob Doss, he's the guy on before me. He's going to be broadcasting over there at Hooters, and uh, the doors open at 11 o'clock. Mm -hmm. and, uh, and what else? Anything else to tell us about this new Hooters on Wolf Road and Colleen? Uh, well, we have 31 HDTVs. We have 16 different tabs, and I just trained um, 50 of the most beautiful Hooters girls. So. Are you a bartender? I am, yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But at Hooters, you have to do both. So you do. If you're a bartender, you're, you know, you're a floor girl, too. Right on. So. And then those... Uh, those things that you wear to make your, your legs look tan there, right? Yeah. I mean, you're very tan already. <laughs> I mean, do the girls have to wear those all the time? Yeah, it's part of the uniform. It's mandatory. Like, oh, yeah. Do some girls, are they like, you know, I've got a great tan. I don't need to wear those things. No, I heard a lot of questioning about that <laughs> this past week because we gave out their uniforms finally. And they were like, you know, I, I'm really pale and, you know, these don't look good on me. And I'm like, no, it's the uniform. Once you get everyone together, it looks uniform, you know. I'm like, that's what we're supposed to do. Yeah, uniforms. So, it, it makes yeah. the hot girls kind of look like superheroes and stuff. Exactly. 
Exactly. <laughs> That's what I think. You know what I mean? Exactly. I mean, you go to a football game, you see these cheerleaders. If you see them in a bar sometimes, you're like, ah, you know, by themselves. But when they're all dolled up and they're all wearing it, they look like superheroes to me. Exactly. <laughs> and that's what we tell our girls, you know. We're like, hey, you know, you have an image to uphold, and, you know, this is what we do. You know, we're Hooters girls, and everyone looks forward to seeing that Hooters girl, you know. So if you fall off the deep end, then you're not, you know, giving off a good image. And we want people to come back, you know. So how long are you going to be hanging around here? Oh, I have to leave tomorrow, unfortunately. Are you going to be around for our broadcast tomorrow? Are you going to talk to Rob Dawes? I will not. Oh. I know. I'm Don't. so sad. <laughs> Normally, I'm here for you know a month solid. So I'm here for two weeks before the opening and two weeks after the opening. But I have to go to the Hooters International Swimsuit Pageant, which is being held next week. So. Got a lot of stuff going I'm on with Hooters. I'm representing our franchise. And <laughs> so we're hoping for, you know top 10 again or higher. So. All right, so have you done the math? Uh, you got this thing going on for the first 200 people in line tonight. Yep. Get uh, wings, 10 wings a week for an entire year. Yeah. 52 weeks, right? Yep. So how many wings are you actually giving away? Like 100,000. 100,000 yeah. wings? Mm -hmm. Oh, man, I hope that works out good. I know. I was doing the same thing. I'm like, this is going to be crazy. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so, like, if you're in line, right? Because not many people, I, I think, would wait in line by themselves. They're going to go in, you know, with their friends. All of them get to go? They get they get to deal with the Well, with the I mean, wings? I... As long as it's first 200 people, I guess, if you, you know, they're yeah. not going to say, oh, you're, that's your friend, you're not going to get them. You know? <laughs> <laughs> you're like, sucker. No. <laughs> yeah, we, um, yeah, whoever it's 200, 200 people, yeah, whoever's first. first 200 people. Oh, okay. I was told it's the first 200 people. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's a joke. <laughs> All right. Tia Jackson, uh, what do you do for fun? I mean, uh, what do you do in your spare time? I mean, you got a name like a pop star or something. Do you sing or something like oh, that? Oh, my goodness. No, I don't. I hear like Tia Jackson, like, oh, what, has she got a YouTube video or something? What? I know. Everyone always says that. I do have a YouTube video, as a matter of fact. Really? You know what? For Hooters. You know? Oh, okay. Yeah. Delightfully the tacky, yet, yet unrefined. unrefined. What does that mean? <laughs> what does that mean? Well, I, you know, we, we push the books of uh, Overboard with, how, how do I say it? Not, not obnoxious hospitality, but we, you know, we try and, I don't know how to describe it to you. Obnoxious <laughs> hospitality. We're trying to go like, like you know, above and beyond basically without being too ridiculous. All right. Well, Tia Jackson, thank you for your time. It's a pleasure to meet you. Thank and you. Uh, have a safe ride back to New England. Go Sox. I will. I know. Go Red Sox. Go Patriots, too. Yeah. Patriots, too. And Celtics, everybody. Yeah, Through do you really watch through. all those? Or you just one of those girls who wears, no. like, a pink, pink Red Sox no, hat? No, okay. I don't wear any of the pink stuff. It's the true colors of okay. me. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Well, uh, go on down to Hooters. Try and uh, win yourself wings for a year tonight. And, of course, uh, Dawsey doing that broadcast tomorrow starting at uh, 10 a.m. And the uh, doors open at 11 a.m. Yes, at 70 Wolf Road in Colony. Hooters, Wolf Road and Colony. All right, coming back, we'll do some ACDC and uh, Space Lodge next year on the queue. Hey, the free beer now. Headphones.